What's up, y'all? I know I haven't did one of these in a long time, like months, but please bear with me. I want to do this little update video for the channel. I want to talk about what happened to me personally and for my channel in 2014 and what I plan on doing in 2015 going this day forward. And I also have a few announcements at the end of the video, so please stay tuned. All right, so I want to go ahead and talk about what happened in 2014 right quick. Um, 2014 was like a really crazy year for me. A lot of different things happened, and it, it, it would be idiotic to go over every single thing that happened. So I'm just going to go over the main parts. Um, mostly, I was working for the city at a really, really shitty job, just you know, cleaning toilets and having to deal with like horrible, horrible co-workers and, and supervisors that didn't know didn't literally didn't know shit about the job um i ended up leaving there and i started doing this uh not to mention like a few other things on the side stuff like that but it's all legal you know don't don't even worry about that but uh i don't regret leaving that job and i feel happy i feel a lot better for it um other stuff that happened first off i lost weight then gained weight and then lost weight again then gained weight again then lost weight again then gained weight again anyway um i had gotten into a relationship before i had left my job and everything was going cool at first you know everything was nice um stuff happened a lot of stuff things were said things were done and long story short i'm not in a relationship anymore so hey whatever um I kind of wish things would have worked out, but, you know, you can't change the past, you know what I mean? So, just, it's not even worth talking about it anymore. So, that happened, which, in turn, kind of did get me away from doing the YouTube thing um, for a good bit. I, I wasn't as focused, I guess, just because... There, I'm just, I just wasn't focused. Now I'm, I'm starting to be a little bit more concerned about what's going on with the channel. And going into 2015, I still want to be doing walkthroughs and game playthroughs. And well, first off, let me go ahead and say something else. The channel has grown to, at the time of this, 1,465 odd subscribers, and that is amazing. You know, and that does happen in one year and six months. I've been doing this for a year and six months. And everyone knows that when you first start a channel, it is difficult to grow. Really, extremely difficult to grow at first. And I'm starting to get a little bit of momentum. And I really like that. And I really appreciate every single view, every like, and all you guys that have been there since day one. And even those who have just gotten uh, hooked on to the channel and have been, like, watching my videos back to back. And, you know, I love that. You know, thank you. Uh... I really do appreciate that. Um, seeing that that's one year and around six months, I can just hope for best uh, for the future. And I know I'm gonna put a lot more effort into my videos and a lot more time and effort into uh, showcasing um, as much content as I can offer, which brings me into what I wanna do for 2015. For 2015, I kinda wanna go back to what I used to do. I used to interact more with subscribers and I really miss that you know I used to play games with you guys you know you guys would like hop on you know one of the games with me and I would play it and record and put it up there you know and I don't do that anymore I want to get back into doing that seeing that now I have a larger fan base now where I can actually you know play multiple games with everyone you know not just a few people so what I really want to do was do game walkthroughs I want to continue doing that I'm also going to create a third channel because my second channel is me a group of friends and we do podcasts and stuff like that it's kind of been inactive for a little bit because i've been trying to figure out what i want to do but i kind of have that down now you know i, I kind of know the direction i want to go in with that second channel so that's gonna you know videos are gonna be popping up on that pretty soon um and those are gonna be me my friend dananu uh, my friend uh razo and ren the wicked and specter if you know if they if they join those are the same people from the podcast they're going to be the same people in the second channel now the third channel is nintendo i have to make a separate nintendo channel because i have a wii it just has been collecting dust because the last time i put up videos of uh, mario kart they got flagged well they well, not copyright strike or anything like that but they got they got content id matched 
every single video and some people aren't even complaining about that because it's not happening to them so what I want to do I want to create a second channel just for Nintendo games because I know nothing is gonna happen for them so I would like to I would like to do that and I would like to also play you know Super Smash Brothers because I just got Super Smash Brothers tonight you know I want to play with with some subscribers on there and other Nintendo uh, people and I've been missing out on that because I've been afraid of what Nintendo would do to my main channel um, other than that that's that's a whole separate thing I don't know what I'm gonna call it yet but y'all can look at for the annotation at the little top bar or whatever what I also want to do is I noticed that when I put up a video a long time ago it's called um, I don't know how to use your old Turtle Beach headsets with the PlayStation 4. That got a lot of views really quickly. It's like 60,000 something views right now. And ever since I've been making review videos of different headsets and different like tutorials of tech and stuff like that for the gaming systems, those have been really gaining more ground than actual like than my actual gameplay videos. So that just tells me that you guys want more of that. You know, and most of my subscribers have come from those kind of videos. So I can understand why most of my gameplay isn't being watched, but my tutorials and my unboxings and reviews are. That, that's going to be split down the middle. I'll, I'm going to be doing more unboxings, more reviews, and uh, hopefully they work out because it seems like they are. And I hope you guys will like that. And I used to always state what the mage stood for in the jolly mage and a lot of people don't know this but it's media animation gaming and entertainment I, I say it in every single intro problem is there's been a lot of gaming and maybe entertainment but not a lot of media and not a lot of animation now the animation part comes in where i want to start learning maya and will get more extensive knowledge on it and start working on animation I have a lot of books and a lot of tutorials and stuff on animation and I want to share that with you guys. So I want to create another little series of videos called a learn along. So pretty much we all get Maya, right? It ain't what well, anybody who wants to do this. We all sit down and get Maya and we learn it together. You know, whatever I learn, you guys learn. So we'll go over step by step you know the the tools of, of Maya how to work them how to use them then we start getting to animation tutorials and we start animating together and we can even share these videos by linking to each other uh, in the videos or labeling labeling them a certain thing so we can actually see and and critique each other's videos and maybe that will catch on and other people will, will notice that and come over and give tips and stuff like that um, I really want to get into that so please let me know in the comments if you guys will want to see that I always used to talk about I want to interview people in the animation and media industry whether it be actors writers uh, animators I said no I, I didn't say that already like all these different people that have something to do with some kind of art um, I want to interview them so that anybody who comes to the channel if they are learning or trying to get into that business they'll have tips from actual people in the industry um, it would be a way for them to learn and grow faster and this would be from subscribers you guys myself um, sending in questions of what they want answered what does it take to be an animator how long do you have to go to school do you even have to go to school do, what about your portfolio what's supposed to be in your portfolio who would I talk to and all that other stuff okay so the announcement part is I used to do giveaways on my channel like when I first started, I used to send stuff to my subscribers, to, to the ones that would, would win it, and it would be random, and it would be like an action figure or something like that. Uh, it started getting expensive when I had to send stuff overseas because my subscriber base was growing, and that meant people from all over the world. I would, I would have to send something like an action figure or a game or something like that to someone somewhere else, and it would cost like $50 or $60 in and uh, custom fees so I want to go back to doing that until I find like a better way of actually sending merchandise to someone overseas I want to go back to giving away PlayStation Network cards and Xbox Live cards I don't think it's gonna be random anymore because randomness when when I would do that it was like well even if you're not a subscriber you just join and you put your name in, in the pot and you know you would just get something for free without even you know paying attention to the videos and I want to make this about the people who actually supported me this whole time I have the feature now on YouTube where your top five people who have interacted with you and your channel you know are are labeled as your top five you know subscribers or top five audience members or whatever it's called 
and I'm gonna be paying attention to that and I also see when people like my videos if you have a Google Plus or Twitter connected to YouTube I can see when people actually hit the like button on my videos or comment on my videos I can see all that stuff so I've really noticed a few people who have been coming to my channel constantly watching videos back to back and hitting the like button and just like staying on my videos for like a long time and I really really appreciate that and I want to give back to you guys specifically uh, for supporting me like that because that's that's what it takes for for this to become like a full-time thing for me and I really would like that also that thing right there I know some some of you guys have noticed that before um, it's like all my trinkets and stuff that I get like either through loot crate or uh, you know statues or whatever that I get I put that all over there and when that fills up at the end of like six or seven months I want to do a giveaway of that stuff, you know, I want to, you know, pass some of that stuff to you guys so you guys can put it on your wall or your mantle, whatever. Um, which brings me to something that I want to do. I want to do a Toy and Tech Tuesday. A Toy and Tech Tuesday would be like an unboxing of either toys, like action figures or those little statues that, you know, Todd McFarlane makes and stuff like that. I kind of want to do those, but I didn't know how it would come across to you guys. Like if you guys would like to see that, that would be awesome and I would make those. It would be like an unboxing. Um, and just showing off the detail of the craftsmanship and, and stuff of the, of the action figures. And that's why I actually have them because I really like the way some of these are made. So I was just wondering if you guys want to do that, I would actually show those on Tuesdays, um, you know, whenever I can. Other than that, I want to really thank you guys for uh, being there for the channel. Oh my gosh, just that was very, very unprofessional. To say thank you for you guys you know, being here for my channel and supporting me this whole way. And I really do appreciate that. And I hope that you guys will, will keep doing this. Just, just thank you so much for that. I, I can't I can't say thank you enough. Also, I want to thank my, my friend Dananu and Razo and the other YouTubers that I've worked with uh, throughout this, this whole thing. I really do appreciate that. And I hope you guys check out their channels. Their channels are linked in the side box on YouTube. I guess if, if it's here, then it's going to be like down here, over here somewhere. Yeah. Oh, also, this month in January, please look out for an interview that I'm trying to I'm trying to get this interview. I don't know if they're going to charge me money, but more than likely, they're going to charge me money to do this interview. But if it goes through, it's invaluable information. I'm going to try to get an animator slash artist from YouTube and from uh the industry works at Marvel uh, and I just want to see maybe maybe this works maybe it won't but let's you know keep our fingers crossed and see if it actually does uh, go through but anyway um any comments or suggestions leave that below subscribe and all the other good stuff and I will catch you guys later peace out y'all